They hope voters will consider their team a slam dunk for Kentucky. Good evening, everyone. I'm Steve Hensley. Leading our news tonight at 6, Senate President David Williams officially announces that he's running for governor next year with Agriculture Commissioner and former U.K. basketball player Richie Farmer as his running mate. WIMT's Dave Spencer has more on the ticket that is already drawing a lot of attention in tonight's top story at 6. David Williams and Richie Farmer have filed their paperwork, making it official they will run for governor and lieutenant governor of Kentucky. But they both realize they have a long way to go before the election. As soon as longtime Senator David Williams and Agriculture Commissioner and former U.K. player Richie Farmer entered the race for governor and lieutenant governor, experience became an issue. Democrats have one opinion. As the president of the state senate, he's turned the state senate into the place where good ideas go to die. And that's a record that he's going to have to live with. It's a record he's going to have to explain to Kentucky on the campaign trail. I don't expect uh, Democratic politicians to be gleeful about the entry of David Williams mm -hmm. and Richie Farmer into the governor's race. Uh, they see us as a, a real threat. Republicans, Phil Moffitt and Representative Mike Harmon, also vying for the governor and lieutenant governor's job, hold another opinion on experience saying it's not necessarily a good thing. I'm an outsider coming in. I've, I've run a business. I've, I've never held political office. And the ideas that I have uh, for state government come from a, from a business mindset. I'm a Kentuckian, that I love Kentucky, and that I uh, have a zeal to try to make this a better place for my kids and all of Kentucky to live and grow up. I think, uh, you know, that's, uh, that's the only qualification that I need at this point. The person with the most experience for the job, Governor Steve Bashir is also looking to reclaim his position and has already started fundraising campaigns with his running mate, Louisville Mayor Jerry Abramson. Williams and Farmer say they will wait until after the November election to start fundraising of their own. While the Democrats and Republicans had their chance to speak today, the voters will have their say at the May primaries. Dave Spencer, WYMT Mountain News.